Hey guys, I have a really cool solution for flight stands for your game. So check out what I have to offer here in this vid and hopefully it'll be useful in your game. So check it out. Let's hit the table and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Hey fellow crafters, I wanted to show you something cool and here it is. It's a Corjo Glass! Yay! Okay, yeah. Now these aren't really exciting, but hey, wait, wait, let me show you this. Okay, so you can stand this up and then I've got my harpy here, and look, I'll set it on the top, and wow, what a great flight stand, right? Just fits right in that nub there at the top, and it won't fall out e easily, it won't fall off. Isn't that great? And then, so here you can do another one. Here I've got uh, a little dragon here. So any medium figures will fit on the top of these. Now, you might be saying, well, hey, DM Scotty, what if I have a larger creature? Well, you can do that too, you can just put this out, and then here's a larger one. The base won't fit in there, of course, but you can set it on top so you still have a flight stand, so pretty cool. And super cheap. You can pick these up at the dollar store. They're cordial glasses. Um, yeah, so pretty cool. And let me show you. There's another large creature. Here, I'll just put that on there. And so you can track all your flying creatures, you know, when they, when they take flight. You can put dice in front of these to uh, symbolize how high they are and that kind of thing. So really cool. Here's another neat feature, right? When it's time to store these things. So let's take our guys off, right? And look, they fit in each other, right? So cool. So easy storage. You just throw those in your little bin or whatever, and you are good to go. You don't have these huge, you know, taking up all this room flight stands. These are just great uh, little cheap flight stands you can get. Now, uh, I, you can get these at the Dollar, Dollar Tree. If you can't find them there, you can check out my Amazon link. They are more expensive there. But if you, for some reason, just can't find them at the Dollar Store, you can get them there. So there you go. Really cool. And I hope you guys like this little tip. And I'll see you next time with some more DM crafting and some more DM advice. Hey friends and fellow gamers, I hope you liked the vid. If you did, make sure you click the like. Also, make sure you subscribe if you're not. And check out my Patreon. I got extra content for uh, people that support me. And uh, I want to thank you guys uh, for checking out the vid. You guys take care. Happy gaming and happy crafting.